replacing, re well, re replicating the hard keys of the phone. So you have, for example, a keyboard you can you can put in. Um, in the end, they can do different things. They can put different U UI on top of that. They could oh. the, the unit which is in here. They they are free to do what they do. So they can put a different UI on that and launch specific apps. Of course, it's open, so we want other sources to join. It's not just us. Um, yeah, and then you can do it. Make it for example, in, in Nokia case, we have free maps, right? So if you have it connected in the car, it's a very good thing to do. So you can, you can, you can maps, use the GPS. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And that's actually things the head unit can do for us as well. It can get the GPS signal from the car and give us that. Because usually, typically, even with the BNDs, you have bad GPS reception and you have these dongles flying around in the car and you don't want that. So in that way, you have it integrated in the car properly and then you can get that back. Also, like speed data or some other information you can get from the car. Because the head unit is connected to the vehicle bus system, the CAN bus. So it has all the internal information. And well, then here you can do basically anything you want. Uh, listen to music, whatever. You can you can launch any, like this is up to now. You can launch apps and, and get better information or news, sport results, whatever. This kind of stuff, you yeah. can browse internet. If you have the apps for that, you can even use like like internet radio stuff, like like uh, Pandora or something. Yeah, it's, it's that, that's technically possible. It, yes, it depends on your data plan, of course, on the phone. Of course, but, yeah. but it does not depend on the data plan. It does depend on. You do it or not? Um, yeah, and it still makes phone calls. <laughs> of course. Okay. And yeah, will it work with Symbian 3 also? Or? Well, we have not re announced any any um, mobile phone to yeah. support it. We will support it. Our new smartphones coming next year. At some point, we'll support it. Okay. At some point, it's not an announcement. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I think until end of next year, we will have smartphones who are supporting terminal both and. Well, Symbian and, and uh, Beagle platform, we need to do all of them, right? Yeah, it's, right it's, yeah. it's, open, it's open, so it's easy to support in different OS, also on the phone side. Yeah. Um, and on the core side, are there already any um, call makers that... But yes, if you wait to the end of the video, C4A, of course, has a lot of members, yeah. mainly the German ones, and we're talking to a lot of other people. Um, the video is actually on YouTube, so you can yeah, download I've that. Seen it. Yeah, I've seen um, it. But there's a lot of interest and a lot of um, actually also very active development ongoing mm -hmm. in different in different locations. But well, if they not announce any products, we yeah. can't, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so okay. at some point they will have it. Okay. And there will be aftermarket devices and uh, OEM solutions at some point, uh, not too far away future. Okay. That's cool. Great.